The man who police say led Officer Irvine and his partner on that deadly chase is in police custody. The suspect arrested for was arrested uh, after that police car crash happened at 76th and Silver Spring yesterday afternoon. Milwaukee leaders met today to discuss the case. Our Casey Geraldo was there and joins us live outside Milwaukee Police Headquarters. Katie and Shannon, the district attorney's office is reviewing possible homicide charges for the 28 year old reckless driver who was arrested Thursday. But more top of mind today is the young officer who lost his life. With flags at half mast, a city mourns. Officer Irvine dedicated his life, sacrificed his life for the residents of this city. Mayor Tom Barrett joined Police Chief Alfonso Morales in remembering 23-year-old officer Charles Irvine Jr. He was a funny and quiet officer who did great impersonations and would give his shirt off his back. He gave more than that. Irvine's photo now sits on Milwaukee's Fallen Officers Memorial. He will be the first added to this list of names in more than 20 years. Irvine served as a police aide for two years before being sworn in as an officer in 2016. This officer was truly a public servant. The investigation continues into the chase and crash that cost Irvine his life. Morales says the driver, who has a lengthy criminal record, and two others are now in custody, while the department offers help to officers mourning one of their own. Our Milwaukee police family is suffering. Please reach out if you need to talk to someone. Irvine's partner, Officer Matthew Schulze, was hurt in the crash, but the police chief was glad to tell us today that he is out of the hospital after being treated for his injuries. Live in Milwaukee, Casey Geraldo, today's TMJ4. All right, Casey, thank you.